Hello y'all, I am back with another corporate overview, and today we are going to be discussing Glacial Aged. Now, uh, they are a consumables company, uh, specifically beverages, um, some alcoholics, some not. So they aren't as um, omnipresent or really well known as Spacer's Choice, they're more niche. And there's a little less content on them, that's why this is a shorter video. Basically, they specialize on making high quality beverages and refreshments for all of Halcyon. They're present on Monarch a little, and in some places we'll get to later. Um, I wouldn't recommend buying their stuff from a gameplay perspective. I, I like the lore of their company, but from a pure gameplay perspective, the stats are the same as a lot of cheaper options. So I wouldn't say there's something you really should buy if you're like um, down on bits, if you're trying to save money. Um, one interesting fact about them I'm getting to now is they have a toss ball team called the Glacial Aged Mammoths. And I think the whole toss ball thing, you know, even though it doesn't show itself in the game, the base game, that much, it's just adds some kind of interesting uh, background to the whole uh, colony in the game. So, one of the places that you see it, and this is the main place you're going to see it in the game, it's not as much seen on Monarch uh, in its full glory, is uh, Byzantium, which is on screen right now. Uh, it's a late game area, so if you don't want to see about it, see anything about it, please click off the video now. Uh, okay, I gave you all a chance to do that. So you're going to find it here because glacial aged products are very expensive and Byzantium has money. So one of the places that it's mainly found is Billingsley's which is a very high class bar. I'm just going in it now. You can see it right here. And they sell every single product that glacial age makes. They sell the iceberg age whiskey you can see here which can also be found a little on Monarch. The glacial age, glacier aged water which is their not alcoholic product. It's more sugary and caffeinated. And then Trippist, Trippistout, I think that's how you say it, which is another sort of alcoholic beer that they make. So I'm just going to drink all of them now, see what happens. And that will stack both the caffeinated and alcoholic effects on you if you drink all their products at once. So yeah, thank you all. Have a wonderful day.